What up, the droid 52 here, the power of Kazakhstan. And today I bring you some Russian power episode 7. And today we're gonna be using AK-74. And that's actually the real name. And uh, it's AK-74 stands for Automat Kalashnikov 74th year. So it was created in uh, 1974. It was made by Mikhail Kalashnikov in 1974 as I said before there's actually a lot of version of this gun there's a standard version AK-74 which was modernized from its previous successor AK-47 and I'm gonna tell about later there's a lot of modifications in this game we use AK-S-74U which is literally translates uh, if you decode all the letters, it would mean like the rifle of Kalashnikov um, Skladnoy. Actually, that means a uh, foldable stock and it is shortened. So it's basically the shortened to a carbine version. Well, you can also classify AK-74U as a submachine gun because how short it is. So now let's just go to characteristics instantly. So since there are many versions of it I'm gonna tell all of them so the weight of the normal AK-74 is 3.3 kilogram AKS-74 is 3.2 kilogram AKS-74U is 2.7 kilogram and AK-74 modernized is 3.4 kilogram the length of AK-74 is 943 millimeter AKS-74 is 943 millimeter with stock extended but with stock folded is 690 millimeter so it's pretty much the same but they just switched the stock with AKS-74 it's the same rifle but they just ma made a stock foldable that's pretty much it AKS-74U uh, with stock extended is 735 millimeters but with the stock folded it's only 490 millimeters which is kinda short uh, AK-74M, which is modernized version, is the same as AK-74, 943mm, but with the stock folded, AK-74M uh, has 700mm. The barrel length of AK-74, AKS-74, AK-74M is 415mm, which they all use the same, but AK-74U uses 200 10 millimeter barrel which they shortened almost to half so all the guns use the same cartridge is 5.5 by 39 millimeter action is gas operated with the rotating bolt rate of fire is quite good that's 600 rounds per minute for the AK 74s but for the AK 74U only it is 650 to 700 rounds per minute which is about the submachine gun range the muzzle velocity is 900 meters per second for the AK 74s, but for AK 74U it is 735 meters per second. Effective range is 600 meters and it has side adjustments from 100 to 1 kilometer. But for the 74U it is 300 to 500 side adjustments. So, um, in general, AK 74U was basically made into the submachine gun version of AK but the normal AKs are basically the assault rifles so the magazine of this gun I kinda of forgot is uh, the same for the all AK-74s it is 30 round or 45 round the AK-74 comparing to AK-47 has a few different things shoots a different round and uh, it has a different stock and uh, the operating mechanism as I told, there were a lot of versions of AK-74. So the first one is AKS-74, which basically has the only thing uh, changed is a folding stock. But AKS-74U is actually a modern, uh, modified version of AKS-74, and uh, it, it has a folding stock and a smaller barrel. 74U actually has a new gas block installed at the muzzle end of the barrel with a new conical flash hider combined with cylindrical mass booster which features an internal expansion chamber that increases weapons reliability. 74U actually has a different sight 
uh, comparing to uh, AK74 it has a U-shaped uh, sight instead of the standard AK sight you know that one that's like sliding and the sight has two settings it's P uh, collaborated at firing at 350 meters or 4 and 5 for 400 and 500 meters the 74U was actually made for the Soviet Army but more specifically the Marines and the airborne guys and of course the special forces because how small it was comparing to AK-47 or 74 there are also a different version of AK-74 which is AK-74 modernized it has the foldable stock that folds into the left and the universal attachments which means that you can put any side any optic side and anything that you want which also instantly eliminated the previous versions AK-74, AKS-74 and AK-74N which stands for AK-74 Knight. There also were AK-100 family that's how it was called it was basically a different versions of AK-74 just with a different barrel, different caliber and stuff like that and different sights so they were like the maybe how should I say the experimental versions or the guns just to fuck around so overall AK-74 the original version is not as popular I think the most popular one is AK-74U because of how short it was and it is a carbine and which kind of resembles the submachine gun and the AK-74 uh, is actually a complete replica of AK-47 but the shorter version is actually uh, is more popular and this concludes my episode 7 of my Russian power and please uh, give me a like that would be really appreciating because it takes a lot of time to create this video and uh, please uh, just I don't know just comment something and uh, subscribe Thanks for watching, the Drive 52 is turning off. The final score is 30 and 5.